I'll take you home, island style represent. Sets. We jump in to explore the reef and to find some dinner. Let's go. Let's go. This place is well known for its mackerel and it didn't take long before we were amongst some impressive fish. There's lots of bait, lots of other fish, sharks, everything. And we were starting to feel like there's no mackerel around. McNabs ended up shooting a barracuda to try and get some burly and a bit of attention. Bobby was about to shoot an MSP and I looked behind him. There's a school of mackerel everywhere and big size ones too. I tried to yell at him to tell him to stop and not to shoot it. <laughs> and I'm like, turn around, look. And as he's looking, there's a mackerel swimming. And then one swims across and I swam towards it, shot it, got a good shot onto it. And then Bobby tries to sort himself out and another one's just following my mackerel. He dives down, takes a shot, hits it. And as it runs though, it snaps his line. My spear gone. We keep swimming for a bit. Tried to get naps, not to put a second shot on mine. It was fine, but there was another mackerel, but. I'm giving the gunning a more mackerel. He already took the shot into mine, and as he took the shot, we seen this massive mackerel come in. Made my mackerel look small. Ooh. And this is my mackerel, and his was heaps bigger. So, made mine look small. And that's one big mac. So we're rushing, take the shaft out, reload. And then he quickly dives down. He doesn't get a perfect shot on it, but hits it. And he has, I think he has a muzzle wrap again. Muzzle at it. And it just tears out, unfortunately. And he wasn't happy, but we got one and there's a lot around. You just got to sort of bring him in. It was now time to switch up and let Rory get in for a spear. These mackerel were definitely hungry for a feed. And they were coming in hot from all directions. With the burly around us, the mackerel were not shy to come in close and aggressive, picking up the chunks around us.
the reel on Rory's spear gun came off and left him in a risky situation to get all tangled, which is not good. But he secured the fish before the sharks could get in and make things worse. We move to the reef top and grab some other good fish. After spearing, we finish off the trip exploring the lively area, getting close to some amazing fish and other sea life. How about that moray eel? Oh, yeah. Swimming over a bommy and spot this big giant moray, big brown giant moray, probably about that, that thick. Just kind of like enticing it and I kind of came out and became interested. So we got the idea of maybe trying to feed it. So I end up cutting the head off and diving down and I'm just holding it out to him and eventually the, the eel comes out and takes the head. Our time was up and while the weather was good, we made the most of it to travel back to the Western Islands. Stay tuned for our next episode where we catch up with the cray divers for the start of the free diving season. Find some fishy spots and dive some places we shouldn't. Eso. Here we are at Black Rocks. Uh, we... Do me a favor, please. Get out of here.